I'm Eric Butts. And I'm Jim Butts. And we are back at SuicideFantasyFootball.com headquarters talking a little bit of football. What's going on with Reggie Bush, Jim? First of all, it looks like he's not going to be a New Orleans Saint. You agree with that first? Probably not. All right. Now, if he's not a Saint, first of all, if you were Reggie Bush, where would you want to land? Anywhere where they would pay me and be stupid enough to give me a contract. Really? You think that little Reggie he's Bush? A he's a weapon, Jim. He's, he's not a weapon. He's scared. He's he. If you can be like a, a, a little around the outside, flea little running back kind of guy, he, he's not. He, he's not good. He's not. He's a weapon if you don't hit him. If nobody touches him, he's a weapon. So you're saying he really didn't have much to do with the New Orleans Saints winning the Super Bowl? No, he didn't have anything. Barely at all. To do. No, he was pro- on the list of ten people that were responsible for New Orleans Saints. He's nine. All right. So you don't think there's at least 10 teams out there that would be way better off with Reggie Bush on their roster than their current running backs? No, than their current running backs? No. They might sell more tickets. They might get a, a Kardashian to come to a couple games or something like that. What? But he's not, I'm telling you, he's not a player. He's not a full-time back. He, he's he's barely a third many, down listen, back. Listen, wait, wait, wait. How many backs in the NFL now are full-time carrying the rock the whole That's what game? I'm saying. He's a, he's a third down back, and he's not even really the greatest because he's soft. Remember the way Sheldon Brown hit him? Dude. He totally went away after that. He was, That game, he really First didn't First of even, all. Sheldon Brown hit anybody there. That was one of the most ruthless hits yeah. I've seen in football. And so you can't discredit Reggie Bush because of how hard he took one of the hardest hits you've ever seen. Listen, I'm just saying he disappears. He's going to want crazy money. I agree with that. He idiot. might not be worth the money that he wants. He, he, listen, if, if, but he dude, gets, listen wait. if he makes the minimum NFL salary and he can return punts for you and play on seven third downs, so that's fine. you're the Indianapolis Colts, and you've had a die just – do nothing year after year. Yeah, yeah. Like sign him because he's going to be the third guy on injured reserve behind <laughs> Joseph Adai and whatever bum you got back in him. So, probably so Dominic just Tavares Ridge. James? Keep, yeah. keep Edge's brother because yeah, he's his last name's James over going out and getting a guy like Reggie Bush who could definitely help you if you put him in as a third down back, change of pace, catching some balls out of the backfield, and returning kicks and punts. You don't think he's a value to have on your For roster. the first four weeks of the season until he's on the sideline with an ice pack on his knee, riding a bike, waving the fans, seeing if he's got his gold earring, and he's, he, Reggie Bush is right above a punter. I totally disagree, and I would love to hear what you guys think. I can't think that everyone out there has that little to think about. Don't get me wrong. Shouldn't have been the second pick in the draft. Mario Williams. Like agree I said, from with draft you. Day, everybody killed me. You can't take Mario Williams. From day one, I knew Mario Williams was going to be ten times the football player that Reggie Bush ever was going to Tell be. us what you think. SuicideFantasyFootball.com. Follow our blogs. Check us out on Facebook. Follow us on Twitter. And uh, tell us what you think. Signing out. Butts and butts.